Swift UI's toggle lets users move between true and false states, just like UI Switch and UI Kit. For example, we could create a toggle that either shows a message or not, depending on whether the toggle is enabled or not. But of course, we don't want to have to track the state of the toggle by hand. We want Swift UI to do that for us. Instead, we should define an at state boolean property that will be used to store the current value of our toggle. We can then use that to show or hide other views as needed. For example, at state var show greeting equals true. vStack toggle is on dollar show greeting text show welcome message dot padding. If show greeting is true, then text hello world. I've made that code so that a text view is returned only when show greeting is true, which means the vStack will decrease its size when show greeting is false, because it doesn't have a second view in its stack. 